The Nord Stream 2 pipeline, which was planned to transport gas from Russia to Germany, bypassing Ukraine and Poland, had its certification suspended yesterday. The move could provide a lifeline for Ukraine, which is believed to have nearly 100,000 Russian troops stationed at the Russia-Ukraine border as many fear an impending land grab. This morning, Defense Minister Ben Wallace and Ukraine's Defense Minister Alexei Yuryovich released a joint statement demonstrating their commitment to preventing a Russian invasion. Our governments do not want to be adversaries or seek to strategically encircle or weaken the Russian Federation. We are concerned about Russia's military construction and activity around Ukraine's borders. But Germany's decision to suspend Nord Stream 2 could have dealt a blow to the West, coming after fears grew in Europe about a gas crisis as Mr. Putin is said to have held back supplies as he seeks approval for Nord Stream 2. With the West backing Ukraine and many EU countries now turning their backs on Russian gas, the timing could signal a change in the balance. As long as the current administration in Kiev remains firmly reliant on a Western alliance rather than Russia, Putin's EEU is dead at home and his larger designs are meant to prevail. Of Russia in Europe and beyond will not be possible.